So, which one idea is best for beginners to develop mobile applications? Is it Android Studio or VS Code? So, we're gonna talk about it today. So, let's start it without wasting our time. To know more, let's go through it. If you look at the functionalities and search result, you will get hang of it that what is most preferable to use for your work. Aside of it, VS Code is I personally use and really love to work with because it supports lots of extensions with it and really good environment. Also beautiful themes available with VS Code. Of course, it's faster than its competitor Android Studio because it's a lightweight IDE. Whereas Android Studio is a little bit messy to work with and on top of it, it's bulky to use, of course, because it consumes a lot of resources like RAM and memory. But if you are going to use emulator with VS Code, you need to use Android Studio. So what I mean, indirectly you have to use Android Studio because you are using Android Studio's emulator. But there are another solutions available though. You can also use your physical device which will definitely reduce the resource consumption and if you want to use third party emulator, you can look up to BlueStacks. And so what is BlueStack? It is an app player which is designed to enable Android applications to run on PCs running Microsoft Windows and Apple's macOS. So what about Linux users like myself? So what type of third party software we have? We means Linux user. Can we can use Genie Motion software which is a cloud based Android virtual devices to boost your test automation or run your app in your website. If you need to know how to use it or test the software on your PC, I'll try to provide you the user's video of BlueStack or say Genie Motion. So what I prefer to beginners like which ID is more suitable for them. So if you are a beginner, go with Android Studio because it's a standard ID for Android development from very long time and Flutter also support Android Studio. You just need to add a Flutter plugin. What more you get in Android Studio? You get pre-installed extensions which you will need through out of the way of app development. As you becoming double quotes pro in coding or say app development, you should jump on to VS Code. It's much better. It's more like interactive ID and above all, it consumes very few resources to run. And of course, if you have very low specs system, you should consider it as your choice. You don't have another choice. So hope you like what you have watched. And if you come so far, that means you do really like this video. Why not give it a thumbs up and show me how do you feel about it by sharing and subscribing to T Sastra. T Sastra. T Sastra. If you have any query, you can ask me in a comment. Uh, I should say thank you for being with me so far.